Hey y'all, Josh here today, aka the world's greatest dad. After a long day of doing dad stuff, there's nothing like kicking back and getting a nice foot massage. What you're looking at here is the Renfo Foot Massager with Heat. Today we're going to unbox this bad boy, show you everything you need to know about it, and see if it might be something you need as well. So with that being said, let's get it. So let's go ahead and start from the beginning. When you pick this thing up, it's going to come to you in a box just like this. Let's get this bad boy opened up and see what we're working with. Here's everything that was inside the box. We got our remote, instruction book, power cord and cable, and our Renfo foot massager. Now I've spent a few minutes going through the product instruction manual and everything's fairly well laid out with the do's and don'ts of the unit, as well as an introduction with pictures showing you exactly how to use this thing. It also has product care and maintenance information, as well as troubleshooting, the warranty policy and customer service. Now I would like to point out that this thing is covered with a one year limited manufacturer warranty. So if you got any issues, Renfro is gonna take care of you. Now with the remote they provide you, you're gonna see you've got five different buttons here, including your power button, your timer adjustment, heat, air intensity, and the kneading. And to activate this, all we're gonna simply do is pull that little plastic out of there. Now the power cord they do provide you with is going to be just over six feet long. So you got plenty of room to connect this thing to a power outlet as well as the massage unit itself. And you're simply gonna plug this right into the side of the unit. So now let's go ahead and go over all the settings and functions of this foot massager, starting right here in the middle with our power button. The blinking red means it's not turned on. We go ahead and hit that button. It's gonna turn everything on the lowest setting. Now over here on the left-hand side, you'll see our timer option. Basically, you got two settings here, the red, which is going to be set for 15 minutes, or the blue, which is going to be set for 30 minutes. We move on down the line over here to the need intensity, and basically you got four settings. You got low, medium, high, and off. Now we move on over here to the air intensity, same thing, low, medium, high, and off. And then finally, over here on the right-hand side is going to be our heat option. And basically this is just an on or off. If the red light is on, that means the heat is on. If the red light is off, the heat is off. Now the heat will not work on its own. You must have either the need intensity or the air intensity on for it to work. So if I turn this over to off, you'll see none of those are on, so the heat can't be on as well. And one other thing I want to point out about the unit is the fact that these foot covers are removable. You simply unzip them all the way around, remove them from their Velcro setting right there. You can throw them in your washer, clean them up, and then install them back in the massager. Now it is recommended that you wear socks when using this foot massager, and it is supposed to accommodate up to a size 13 foot. Now I have a size 12 wide foot, and I really have no issues getting my feet inside or outside this. We're gonna go ahead and power up the unit using the remote. And by default, it's gonna set us up on the lowest 15 minute time setting. So I'm gonna hang out here for about 15 minutes. We'll check in with you in a little bit. So I'm about 12 minutes into this 15 minute foot massage. And I gotta say, this thing is an absolute beast. I went ahead and did five minutes on the lowest setting, five minutes on the middle setting. And now I'm doing the final five minutes on the high setting. I've had the heat on the whole time. It really took about seven to eight minutes for this thing to really get cooking, but now my feet are super nice and toasty. So warm, I'll probably turn that part off for the rest of the massage. Overall, I've thoroughly enjoyed the low, the middle, and really liking this high setting right now as well. So we went ahead and did about 20 minutes. Let's go ahead and turn this thing off. And man, that thing feels pretty darn good. Now, after unboxing this bad boy, fully checking out the features and giving it a full test, I gotta say, this is probably one of the coolest products that I've gotten in the mail in a long time. So let's go ahead and close this out with my three takeaways. Number one, I love the fact that this offers heat along with the massaging function. Now, this wall right here is an exterior wall in my office, and I live in a pretty cold climate. So during the winter, we can get a little draft in there. This thing's gonna be awesome under my desk to so just put my feet in, get a nice massage, warm my feet up, and I'm good to go. Number two, I love the fact that this thing has multiple settings from low to medium to high, and it's also got both the kneading and the air pressure. Now at the highest setting, this thing is definitely intense, and this definitely isn't some little cheesy foot massager that just kind of rubs your feet. 
And number three, I love the fact that Renfo stands behind their product and they're giving you a full one year warranty with great customer service. So if you got any problems with this thing, get a hold of them and they'll get you taken care of. It's for those reasons and more, I'm easily giving this Renfo foot massager a world's greatest dad thumbs up and I say, go out and get you one. Hey, one more thing before you go. I want to let you know that the Renfro company is a big fan of the World's Greatest Dad's in-depth and informational videos. Therefore, about a month ago, they reached out to me and asked me if they could send me this foot massager for video review purposes. Now, with that being said, all the thoughts and opinions expressed in this video were my own, and I always do my best to accurately describe any product I review. Now, I hope this video helped you out, and we'll see you next time.